Hello YouTube, AZ Scratchers here. What we have in front of us today is a full book of the Arizona $5 500 loaded scratchers. Uh, I've already scratched the um, numbers, but I have no idea what's under them. So I have the winners separated from the losers. There were 44 losing tickets out of the book of 60 and 16 winning tickets. So we can dispense with the 44 right off the bat. We're only interested in these. And uh, the overall odds of this, for those that pay attention to this sort of thing, are 1 in 3.85. Let me get everything stabilized here. Bring it up a little bit tighter. And so I don't have this focusing issue. I will reach over here and switch it off autofocus to manual. There we go. So now it should be stay focused for the rest of the session. Okay. Uh, it was an interesting book. It started out very slow. The first five tickets were nothing. Then I had two winners. Then I had four with nothing. One winner. A solid eight with nothing, which kind of spooked me a little bit. And I had a winner. Then I had five with nothing. Two winners in a row. Um, two losers in a row. Another winner. Three losers in a uh, three losers in a row. Then I had a winner, and then I had six in a row um, with no wins. And then uh, one win, five in a row with none. Three in a row were winners. Missed then a loss, then another winner, then two losses, two winners in a row, uh, three winners in a row, and that ended it. So the book started out slow, and it picked up towards the end. And without further ado, we'll get cranked up here. I can tell you right now, there were no uh, winning burst symbols for 500, but that doesn't mean there's not a 500 in there somewhere. Lots of little dollar bill symbols, a few number matches here and there. So we'll get started. First winning ticket is 005, and we have on this one, one win for five bucks. This is going to be kind of a complicated session because I'm going to keep track of all this. So we have five there. The next ticket was 006. We had two back-to-back -back wins. And on this one, focus is still good, we had a flying dollar bill for another five. Oh, excuse me. Don't want to forget the bell. So we have five there. The next ticket here was ticket 11 with one, one match for 46 here for another five. There'll be lots of bell ringing because we know these are all winners. Depending on the size of the win depends on how many bells get rung. On this one, ticket number 20, we had that quite that stretch of a eight with no winners. Then we had twenty. We have two matches: a flying dollar bill and a twenty-two. We have a ten and a five for fifteen. All right. Let's hope there's a really nice outlier in here. You know, like a five hundred. Oh, or a fifty thousand would be kind of nice. I'm not going to argue with any of those. There are no $100 wins in this game. It goes straight, straight from 50 to 500. And the next number, the next ticket was 26 with a match of 35 on number 35. So we have a $5 win there. By the way, this is the last time I will be ever scratching this particular game. Random Red and I had a little contest going, which we basically decided we've had enough of. I basically told him he was going to hit it hard this week one last time, and I said, well, I was only going to do 20 or 30 tickets, and I said, what the heck? If we're going to go down in flames, let's do it first class. So I went with a whole book. On this ticket, we only have one mini matching number, the flying dollar bill, ticket 27, for 10. And the next ticket is ticket 30 where we have one match flying dollar bill 
for five bucks. The next ticket, we have two matches. We have 39 there, wait, actually, well, three, excuse me, 39, 39, a flying dollar bill. So we have three matches on this one. Let's see what this brings us. Five, 10, 15. Probably should have rung the bell three times, but twice is enough. The next ticket, ticket 42, had one match on number 41 for five bucks. And what do we got next here? On ticket 48, we have two matches, five and the flying dollar bill. We got a fiver and another five for 10. All righty. The next ticket was ticket 49. The flying dollar bill and a number 30. We got a fiver and a five. The next ticket, ticket number 50, one match on number nine for another five bucks. On ticket 52, we have one match on number 45 for 10. The next ticket, 55, and I don't think I missed any, but if I did, I'm sure somebody will notice it. We just have the flying dollar bill for another five. Ticket 56, we have one match, two matches, 48 and uh, the flying dollar bill. So we'll see what this is. Five and 10. Alrighty, and the final ticket, ticket 57. We have one match, flying dollar bill for another fiver. So, that was pretty sad. It went more or less as I expected it to go, though. I hate to be pessimistic, but my dealings with this ticket have been, shall we say, less than stellar. Okay, we got five there. That makes 10 makes 15, then 20, then 30, then 35, then 45, then 55, then 60, 75, 80, 90, 5, 110, 115, 120, 125. $300 book back 125. And that is why you will never see Arizona Scratchers, or AZ Scratchers, excuse me, ever play this ticket again. I've taken it in the neck too many times with this game. Um, and I don't recommend anybody in the state of Arizona ever play it ever again. This ticket needs to be put out of its misery as quickly as possible with extreme prejudice. So, there you have it. That was my last hurrah on the 500 loaded tickets. 
Uh, Random Red, I wish you better luck than I had. <laughs> you, I mean, you could hardly do any worse. Um, so that's about it. I hope you enjoyed this session, and I hope you enjoyed this learning lesson in what tickets not to play. So, that's it. Uh, if you like what you saw, hit the like button, comment, subscribe, notification bell. Uh, we're going to go back to more seeing tickets tomorrow because uh, this one really just didn't cut it. And I, and I did two full books of these things. This is the second book. So, yeah, this was definitely a loser. Loser cra straight across the board. I got no warm fuzzies from this, this ticket at all. And uh, it's, uh, it is what it is. Anyway, but that's the lottery. You got to take your chances. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, and until next time, this is AZ Scratcher signing off. And we'll see you later. Have a great day or great evening. Bye.